SEO, search engine optimization, getting to the very top of the list. We're just left with Google now. It's a verb, it's a noun, it's a place. It's ubiquitous. Google something. You've got to be on there. The General Outdoor Advertising Company, the leader in its field, has developed a completely scientific method of locating its advertising plants. There was really no SEO before. I mean, I know if you wanted to be at the front of the phone book, you named your company AAA, and then that was your company name. Junk mail, printing paper that we all of us sort out and immediately discard. If it's 1981, people are not going to get your phone number from anywhere but the yellow pages, the side of a bus, or somebody else is going to tell them. That's pretty much it. So right off the bat, you don't know what, if you want a plumber, you there might be a section. I honestly, I don't even. I've never used a phone book to look up anything. I was luckily able to skip that part. You'd have to go through each listing and know the names of the streets, and then open up a map and do all of that. Now it's just right there. You actually know who is closest to you from using your phone, from your website, from anywhere. A retail outlet fails or prospers according to its relative accessibility to buyers. Ask yourself how many times you've gone to page two of Google. Not often. If I haven't found what I need on the first page, I give up and search something else. It's just not right if you're not on page one. And you want to be known to everyone around you who is closest to you. You really don't get much better value than, than a targeted SEO campaign. You don't pay unless you're page one. And you don't pay if you fall off page one. There's absolutely no point in buying or paying for SEO if you're not going to be on the front page. Being on page one of Google is going to ring your phone.